Hello, ladles, la littles, ladles and gentlemen. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am currently in Claremont, Florida. I'm here tonight because it is currently almost five. I'm here tonight because my friend, my mom's friend, our friend Lisa is launching her new business tonight. I made a detour on the way to Claremont though and I stopped at the airport and I picked up a guest. Adam is here with us now and so we, he has graciously agreed to come to the launch party with us, with me, uh, just because it's tonight and there he is. Hi! He's fishing a mask out of his bag. Oh, hopefully. But we stopped because we're hungry. So we're here. The lunch party doesn't actually begin until six. So we have some time to eat. And we found a Mexican restaurant. My mom has eaten here before. And she says it's really good. So we're gonna go in and check out this rec restaurant, Mexican restaurant. Restaurant is what was gonna come out. I can't talk today, apparently. So we're gonna go in and we're gonna eat. I don't know if I'm gonna vlog any of this tonight but I will pick you guys up tomorrow because we've got some things planned for tomorrow. So you've seen me, you've seen him, we're gonna have dinner and you guys will see us in just a second. Our food just came. I have the Junior um, San Jose Burrito. For reference, this is my hand. This is the Junior. The, they have a regular size that's bigger than this, but Adam got the chimichanga. Mm -hmm. And then we have margaritas. I got a frozen passion fruit margarita. And we also have queso, which is currently living in his beard. <laughs> so embarrassed. <laughs> no, you're saving it for later, right? Uh, sure. <laughs> it is now Friday. I'm gonna turn the radio off. And we are at the bank. I just finished depositing a check, and now we're gonna go to Lakeland, all three of us, because uh, we're gonna go to Ulta to get our eyebrows waxed because I have a coupon. I love coupons. And um, what else are we gonna do? We're gonna go to Bed Bath & Beyond because our friend Ines wants a seat cushion. And then we're gonna go to the Brass Tap and check out their beers. And Emma's hungry, so yes, I am. we're gonna find something to eat. But it's gonna be a very fun afternoon out and about. You excited? Very excited. Very excited. We made it to Ulta. Well, we came because I wanted to get my eyebrows waxed, but turns out the brow girl here at this Ulta is on vacation for the next two weeks, and the one, the other one near us is on maternity leave for now. So I am just gonna forfeit my coupon, I guess, but I did come because I need a hairbrush. And this one is the wet brush, Go Green Detangler, but nowhere on the box does it say what makes this hairbrush green. It's supposed to be eco-friendly. I have no idea what makes it that way. Maybe it's because it's in a cardboard box. I have no idea. Weird. Whatever. I need to find Emma before she spends too much money. I wouldn't say that that was a total bust because we did get some stuff, but Emma's stuff was on sale and I got a new hairbrush. We're hungry and Adam likes beer so we're I'm bringing him to the brass stop because this place is really impressive with the number of taps that they have so we're gonna go in and check it out uh, um, Emma and I've been here before mom and I come here used to come here more often we don't come here as often anymore but this guy's never been here so we're gonna take him in and show him what it's all about mm -hmm. I got a flight whoop 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 and these are called well, I guess they're all in the sour slash acidic and funky ale styles family. Well, Adam and I have had our beer flights. We had some chips and queso for a snack, and now we are headed to Bed Bath & Beyond to get a, a chair cushion for our friend Ines, who is like 80 something years young, and she's very politely asked us if we would help her find one, and so I'm gonna see if I can find her a purple cushion. You going into Books a Million? Uh, I don't think I've ever been into a Books a Million. Okay, we're making a pit stop in the bookstore just because. <laughs> Found the cookbooks. And there's our friend Maddie. <laughs> you guys know I love this guy and his cookbook is actually really good, but if you watch him on YouTube, he's a little bit coarse. All right, so we're here in Books a Million. I found a book I love. Uh, Leela, I think her name is Leela Meekum. Yeah. But this one, $5.97 is bargain price. I don't have this one. I've wanted this one for a while. It's been on my to buy list. 
Um, but I found the cookbook, the keto cookbook that I use all the time that has my butter chicken recipe in it. I wanna show you guys this. This is my favorite keto cookbook of all time and it's actually not so big, so it's not so thick, but it has a bunch of recipes in here and I think it's only uh, $14.95, so it's not so expensive, but it's a really great cookbook and they do have it here at Books A Million and I will have it linked in the description box below. They also have a ton of gifts here, like they have a purse with a Winnie the Pooh on one side and that's the back side of it, it's got Eeyore on the other. They have a really cool Stitch mug where Stitch kind of turns around and a Maleficent sleep mask, the Little Mermaid. And over here they've got Peter Pan and Pinocchio. But I love these. Look how cute that is. It's like a box lunch inside a bookstore. All right, leaving BAM or Books A Million. And I have made it out with one book. Now we're going into Bed Bath & Beyond because I know they have purple seat cushions here. But I can't think of anything else we need here other than the seat cushion. All right, they have pillow pads, but what I'm here for is one of these. Gotta love the purple. So it is summertime here in Florida, and of course you've got your patio egg mosquito deterrent, and you've got your off citronella candle, and then you've got your other citronella candle, and you've got your insect killer torch, and then you've got your gallon sized, several gallon sized candle in a bucket. Like, this is massive this is a pail and it's only $49.99 so what's holding you back get two have we really evolved to this stage where we have to have like a box to keep our disposable and reusable masks in like do we really need to pay eight dollars for a case to keep our masks in what's wrong with like a paper or plastic bag I was hoping these things were gonna go away. Apparently we're keeping them around forever. On the plus side, you can have a clip-on beverage holder. That's really nice. Next stop is ABC, just for fun. Just to see what they have. Because I always love checking out the liquor store. It's always fun to go in and just see what's on sale. You guys, it's April. It's April 30th but it's on sale. So one of the things we look at when we come to ABC is the yellow tag, because these are clearance tags. So on clearance today for $11.99 instead of $14.99 is gingerbread spiced Captain Morgan. Tis the season for eggnog and gingerbread in April. Merry Christmas. Right? Seriously, I have no idea what's going on. This one's not on sale, but this one is probably my favorite. Um, usually we get it when it's $5.99 or $4.99, so it's actually gone up in price for being an April out of season. Well, folks, it is Saturday morning. I never finished the vlog yesterday. It's been complete chaos around here. We had a 11 o'clock, no, 10.45 run to Walgreens last night. We ran in, we were all in our pajamas, and we raided Walgreens for Reese's and a prescription. 10 minutes before closing. Yeah, it was wild. <laughs> We watched the Disney Wish reveal video last night. And we have some thoughts, I have some thoughts. I have some really unpopular Disney opinions and I'm not gonna share them all here with you right now. I will say I am really excited for the concept art that they showed us for the Walt Disney Theater. Uh -huh. It's green instead of red. And I just kinda like that they changed that a little bit. I think it's beautiful. But it's still gilded. And there are some other things that I'm not so excited about. How dare you build a Disney cruise ship and not put an animator's palette on it? Mm -hmm. My heart is a little bit broken. So, I have some unpopular Disney opinions, and if you want to message me on Instagram, if I trust you, I will share them with you. <laughs> if I don't trust you, I'm sorry. There's nothing I can do, there's nothing you can do. I'm not gonna share my unpopular Disney opinions on the internet so people can bully me about them. And you also, you can't change my mind. Anyway, 
Um, I'm gonna end this vlog here. The next one is gonna be less chaotic because today we are in the car. We're actually parked in front of a Starbucks right now. Um, we are going to Tampa because we're going to do the Tampa Brew Bus Tour today. And so that's gonna be the next vlog you guys see. And I'm actually really excited about it. I think it's gonna be really fun. We've wanted to do this since we moved here. And, and learned about it. And learned about it and we've never done it. So we're really excited to try it today. So you guys will see that in the next vlog, but you guys have had enough of me for now. So you'll see me later.